Whether you're a high school student, parent, or high school counselor, welcome to our CMSB Admission YouTube channel. From vlogs to tours and webinars, this is the place to see how life is as a CMSB student. Subscribe today. What's going on, guys? Hey, guys. So, um, I'm packing right now. As you guys can see, my whole living room is a mess. But I was thinking, like, hey, I'm packing. What shouldn't I pack? So that's what this video is going to be about. What should you not pack for college? I'm going to give you 10 things. 10 things not to pack for college. Especially your freshman year, okay, okay? So I hope you enjoy it. I look a mess though, so give me like three seconds. Boom. Right? What's going on, everybody? Welcome to another YouTube vlog with me, Caitlin. And this video, like I said before, is 10 things you should not. You should not not bring to college because that is a thing that is a thing there's things that you should just leave at home okay why are you bringing that to college and there's things that you think that you can bring but the college doesn't allow so i'm gonna tell you right now yeah, yeah let's get into it i know all of you guys are packing right now so this can be very helpful so i hope you guys watch it hope you guys enjoy it and it's gonna be quick and simple ready Let's go. By the way, stay tuned for August 22nd. Like I said before, I'm going to do an essential dorm room vlog. Basically, what you should bring to college. So, stay in tune for that as well. Okay, okay, okay. One, don't bring your whole closet, bro. Don't bring your whole closet. Like, you definitely don't need every single clothes. I live pretty close to the school. So, uh, I'm going to say people that live, like, hours away like they can drive and stuff like that don't bring all your clothes bro like don't you need seasonal clothes you have time to go get all those clothes during your breaks or like holidays and stuff like that so for right now bring like bring fall clothes because it is gonna get it's gonna start getting colder and stuff like that like in october end of september so bring sweaters and stuff like that but don't 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 bring your whole closet like just don't number two bro don't bring every single shoe you have i know i know bro like it's different because you're not a commuter like commuters have time to get fly and like to actually put clothes on but we don't like literally i swear you're gonna bring like 20 shoes for no reason you're definitely gonna use um your crocs and like probably two pairs of sneakers Bomb, but I'm telling you right now, you're not gonna use all of them. So bring like five or five pairs, bring um, a pair that you can get dirty with, bring like your favorite sneakers. Definitely, y'all should all have Crocs. Yeah. Number three, um, no air fryer. <laughs> no air fryer, no hot plates, no nothing that can like physically catch on fire in your dorm. I know it's sad because air fryers are kind of like easy to make like quick snacks and stuff like that, but don't. Unless, no, don't. Just don't. Don't bring it air fryer. Number four, don't bring any furniture. Like, you guys can bring like storage or like things that you guys want to put like your stuff on. That's cool. That's cool. But literally, the school provides you with a desk, a chair, uh, like, um, Okay, yeah, I couldn't say it in English. I'm gonna remember when this video is over, but they're gonna provide you with drawers. And then you're gonna have a closet. You're gonna have everything that you necessarily need, very essential in a dorm room. Number five, uh, no candles, guys. Like I said before, with like the air fryers, they're basically, they basically don't want you guys to bring it because it can catch on fire and like, just smoky stuff. Just, just don't bring candles. Like, I love candles too, but like don't, don't bring it. Don't. Yeah. Or they're gonna take it away. So it's up, it's up to you. Bye. Okay, this is not like a not to bring, but don't don't do basically. Um, you and your roommate have to split it. Like one of you guys buy the fridge and one of you guys buy the microwave. Don't come. Don't come with a microwave and a fridge if you know your roommate bought the fridge because you guys are not allowed to have two fridges and two microwaves. Got it? 
Okay, go. Cool. For seven, you guys don't need to bring a printer. If you want to, I'm so down. Like that's so essential to have in your room. But you also have a lot of access to different printers on campus. Number eight. We're almost done. We're almost done. We're almost done. Okay, this is just a tip that I've learned in college. But don't bring any of your, like your high school things. Like definitely look odd because everyone's wearing C Miss B merch and then you just bring it like you just stuck in high school. And like for real, for real. Don't don't bring so much high school shirts because you're definitely gonna get more merch from your college and you definitely wanna rep that. Okay guys, number nine. Number nine. Um, um uh, school supplies i know that sounds hella dumb right now but i am so serious like in college you need probably three things you need your laptop slash ipad whatever works for you like an electronic device electronic device and then you need a notebook and pens and pencils literally those top three things Whew. number 10 Okay, so last but not least, this isn't a really big one, but I know a lot of people love to like decorate their rooms and that's very necessary. Like for people that like get homesick or just want a cool vibe, you know what I mean? Don't bring so much throw pillows. Literally that was me freshman year. I brought like 10 because I wanted my bed to be mad cute. Literally at the end of the day, they're on the floor. So if you want, just bring two or three, you know, hype your bed up, but don't don't bring so many pillows because you're probably only gonna use one and then the rest are gonna be on the floor. So yeah!